and here at Optima here at CS 2018, you have a 4K ultra short throw laser. Right, this is a model that we are um, looking at doing, bringing to market in the, in the coming, say, couple of quarters. It's a 4K uh, laser light engine based off an ultra short throw optical system. So basically, in about two foot, at two foot distance, you can get over a hundred inch vertical or diagonal image on your projector. Um, it's around 2300 lumens right now that it's testing with an extremely high contrast ratio and very great color. Now, so two million contrast ratio? Yeah. Great contrast, great color ratio. How is that possible? Is it thanks to the laser? It's with the laser light source that we're able to come up with that. So is that because it, uh, lasers are brighter, or what does it do? It's just the way the laser light's being produced versus the lamp laser, and we're not, you know, we're able to get just more throughput with the light, and it's more efficient usage of light. It's like now, it pops up more than yeah. it, 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 it. The eye per perceives a lot more color when coming from laser. Something that we're looking at here, and again, it's a prototype, but it'll be sometime, say, towards the end of Q2, and we're going to be in that four to five thousand. Um, maybe up to six thousand dollar price point with this product. When because it comes to some of the companies are doing well, threshold throw 1080p at three thousand. Right. So that would be much better to get the four thousand. Right. So right? you can step up and, to the four K. That's laser. the idea. Right. With All the right. Laser. Exactly. And um, and this is a prototype of the finish. This isn't the final ID yet. You know, we're just showing the engine itself that it runs and we're ready to go with it. And uh, so so this is totally prototype, but yes. so somehow the laser compared to yeah. the other technology, so, the LED, what, yeah. is it like? Totally different architecture inside for the light engine. Yeah, it's a, com it's a completely different engine than we've always seen. So basically, the through here, there's a couple of laser banks that are that are sending light into a central area where it's all condensed into one, and then it comes across, uh, hits the DMD mirrors, and then it run comes out through the through the front end. And obviously. laser is also suitable for the traditional, uh, <coughs> not short throw. Oh, absolutely! You can put it in any one of your uh, any one of your type of projectors. It could be a standard throw projector, could be a really large one. So, say a, a conference room or a uh, you know a giant auditorium, all the way down to something you know home based. So, laser's a great light source. The great benefit of laser is, of course, that it gives you twenty thousand plus hours, and you never change it out. Right? Lamps you have to change out. Lasers you never do. But uh, the lamps are getting better too, right? Lamp life is increasing, increasing, absolutely. But laser, you never change out. It's it's once in and never comes out. It's and a solid state. It's not a... when there are LED DLPs too, that, that's L also LED, very long. The LEDs also. It's a solid state technology. Lamps really are an analog, if you think about it. Lasers are a digital technology. But LED DLP is not possible to do for you, big projectors, you, you only both. for you, you can do pocket both. projectors? No, you, you can do ones. both. Lasers, easier to get bright, fast. Big, it's easier to do, I mean, how do I say that? It's easier to do a laser, a bright laser, than it is a bright LED. And it just has to do with the size, right? Laser is a more intense light source. LED is, is a larger bank is required to get the brightness. And sh ultra short throw is always more expensive than the, the traditional it's, it's way? Correct. It's just because of the lens? It's because of the optics. optics. There's more optical elements and they are more complex to do ultra short throw versus standard. But for now, the laser is going to be a step up from everything right. else, right? And ultra short throw is a step up as well over standard throw optics. And so, uh, so is this using the... the 0.67. This is based off, yeah. So it's, this is using the, the, the first Pixel generation shift. TI. It's using the first generation TI um, 4K chip, and, and we're all uh, DLP chip. Basically, there's eight million pixels that are being addressed on the screen at every at every instant, and the definition from the CTA, and we are logoed and certified by CTA to have that eight million pixels. So we do have the same logo, say for example, that goes on the on flat panels, but we do bigger a whole lot better than flat panels ever will. And how big can it go? So we've taken this out to 130 inch. Right here we're at 100 inch, but we've taken it to 130 inch on this. Which, and you super know, clear. You, yeah, and you think about 130 inch panel, you can't really put that in a home, but you can certainly do it with a, with a, you know, a, 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 an ultra short throw projector and just drop it down and you're ready to go. Uh, and how would you say the, the, this pixel shift technology, is it as clear as a native 4K chip? Um, I, I, th I think we let our eyes tell the difference on that, right? It's and like it sure looks, it looks there, awfully right? clear. All 8 million pixels are being addressed, which is the requirement to be 4K. That's super cool.